Yeah, this video is about my Wu Tang American Saga review. So far, I like it, man. I ain't gonna front on it, despite it not having you God in it. So I feel like they really can't tell the whole story without all the key players or or people gonna say that you God don't play a significant part in the Wu Tang Saga or whatever. But so far, it's been a struggle, man. You see how the Wu had a struggle. We see how RZA was the glue linking all the people together. And he had a vision and a pure love for music. You know what I mean? Son. And one thing I remember about the 90s, that son, everybody was like, son, son, son. And then, then watching this is kind of reviving that in me, you know, calling people son. Even though I was saying that before this came out, just because me being a 90s baby too. So, what up, son? But so far, it's straight. Like, I ain't know Reza brother was the plug or whatever. And like how, like... The two, like, Stapleton and Park Hill was beefing or whatever. And, like, the two people, like, Richard's brother, Divine, and the other dude named Power or whatever. And, like, you put their name together. It's, like, Divine Power when they were together, but they broke up. So now it's, like, Divine over here and Power over here. And then they, you know what I mean, manipulating the beef on both sides or on their side. That shit is deep. But everybody got a pure love for music. So you see how when they did that contest, they were all separated or whatever. And then RZA said that we got to be united. Because, you know, black people never come together and unite anyway. So RZA had that idea after that contest, even though that contest was rigged. I don't like how they did Ja's son. Everybody got to bite that bullet. It's deep, man. And it's like, will Divine ever get out? But Divine making connects and shit. I'm glad he got the other side to see that when we outside of you know, that island, that we need to be united. And then when we on the island, we could send my beef, but just know it's Shaolin versus the world. That was deep to me. And a lot of stuff, man, like the people that's portraying these people in the movie, that on, like that one dude from the get down, Curtis Blow, forgot his real name, but he plays um Raekwon, man. Like like the like the mannerism and the face the facial expressions, he got him down packed, man. And even the dude that played RZA. Like, he dead on, too. Like, how RZA be, you know what I mean? Just so, you know what I mean? Cool and suave and shit. And then, like, Dave East, he always, you know what I mean? Got that, you know what I mean? He remind me of meth so much. You know what I mean? Dave East, Dave East and shit. He remind me of the nigga meth so much, yo. Light-skinned niggas and shit. But, um... That's why I said it's looking like a classic, man. Despite you guys not being in there or whatever. And then um, I kind of didn't recognize recognize um Ghostface, but now looking back, he always wore do rags. That Ghostface always wore do rags, man. That's crazy. So. Yeah, this is one of my parts or whatever, part two to that Wu-Tang saga.